What's up guys, welcome back to another YouTube video looking at Bandit level 32 from the new challenges of the Overwire Wargame site. So this prompt here is after all this Git stuff, it's time for another escape. Good luck. So this challenge is not about using Git. Uh, once we are logged in, we notice in the home directory there's this file called Upper Shell. Uh, it is a set UID binary, so it's looked like it's running as Bandit 33. When we go ahead and run this, it says, welcome to the uppercase shell. And it looks like everything that we try and do is converted to uppercase, so we can't particularly run the normal commands that we want to be able to, like, move forward. Okay, that sucks. How do we get around this? <laughs> um, well, I, I, I poked around and I tried to research and I figured there were, okay, maybe some interesting bash variables or bash techniques I could take advantage of, like, or like redirecting um, standard error or something out to... Uh, another file, right? Because if I were to try and redirect like regular output to anything, I can try that. But okay, it looks like I have to be in a directory where I could actually create files, right? So I figured like, all right, let's move to a temporary directory. Um, soup, slime, soup, sloib. Ew, that one sounds weird. <laughs> so let's get over there and then let's go ahead and run upper shell again. Now we can actually try and redirect things. Like if I wanted to put dollar sign underscore, just get a string, I can redirect that to uh, anything. Um, don't know why that's hanging. Weird. Huh. Okay. Now let's check out what anything particularly has in here. Cat, uppercase anything, looks like it heard all that, and it got some of the output that came with it. So, interesting things, looks like that's the output from the shell that we're getting. Those are interesting variables that I could take advantage of if I really wanted to. But there was some idea that I've seen from other people that we were discussing this in the Discord chat. Some people were able to create an uppercase script that would just go ahead and run regular commands. Like if I wanted to just invoke bash, I could do it just like that after I mark it executable. And then from the uppercase shell, we could simply run um, whatever temp directory that we're in the script.sh and then it puts us just in bash and we can run things however we particularly want to and we are bandit 33 so we could cat out the password just like that bandit pass bandit 33 that's a good way to go um the technique that i actually fell into and found on accident was uh just testing again more of those strange bash variables that let me do interesting things so while i was in the uppercase shell i actually tried to run dollar sign zero which would invoke like the first argument or typically itself, like the program execution itself. And it brought me just a regular shell. Like I was able to determine that, okay, I am just now running SH. So I'm still bandit 33. So I could just like that cat the bandit pass and move on. That's how I ended up finding it. But other people, after I discussed the solutions, once I had solved it through that dollar sign zero method, people had told me they created that uppercase script. Uh, and both of these are pretty valid solutions. I think both of them worked really, really well. Uh, whatever. There's plenty of ways to skin a cat in Linux, you know, and or just get the solution you particularly need. So bandit 33 is at the moment uh, not developed yet, but it looked like they've been releasing levels slowly um, since yesterday. So that's kind of cool that we were just on the front lines getting these new challenges that like come out. Um, and I've been sharing that love in the Discord server. So if you want to join a small community of other cool hackers, CTF players, and programmers, this is a cool place to do it. I'll, I'll include the Discord link in the um, description. So along with that, I want to give a shout out to my supporters on Patreon. All of these individuals are fantastic. Thank you so much for everything that you do. I really appreciate what you're willing to provide for this channel. It really helps me grow. Uh, it helps the, the channel develop and honestly just motivates me and inspires me to keep making cool things. So thank you so much. One dollar on Patreon will give you just this little shout out at the end of every video. Five dollars a month on Patreon will give you early access to my videos that I normally record in bulk or in mass and YouTube will just gradually release them. Hey, if you did like this video, please do press that like button if you're willing to leave me a comment maybe subscribe and uh check me out on patreon discord and my website www.johnhammond.org see you soon